workers. Go to the, the boss. A picket line means do not cross. cross. Along North Columbia, members of Laborers Local 483 and supporters gathered to picket Saturday afternoon outside of the wastewater treatment plant. Richard Beadle made sure to come by. I'm retired with the local. I used to used to manage the local and uh, uh, I'm here to support my, my brothers and sisters in this fight. These folks are some of the hardest working people in the city. They're the people who maintain your streets. They're the people who maintain your parks. They clean your water to make sure that the river runs clean. The environmental systems is open 24-7. James O'Loughlin, a field rep for the union, said Saturday marks day three of the strike. We've been out here since Thursday at midnight. Uh, we are currently in a mediation session with the city. Uh, we're hopeful that they'll see the ridiculous expense they're putting into uh, trying to throw legal injunctions at us, you know, suppress our right to strike, wasting police officers' times out here. Um, you know, doesn't amount to much compared to money that would honor the work our folks do, um, which is going to keep people in these positions long term. Negotiations between union representatives and the city have gone on for about 10 months. The city explained it's offering a 12% wage increase by July, half of that retroactive to 2022, and a 5% cost of living increase each year. But the union wants the city to remove that annual 5% cap. I mean, it's the pinch that everybody's feeling, um, but the city has been comfortable just allowing these kind of default pay cuts to occur. A uh, little inflation there, some furlough days over here, concessions there, you know, state mandated cuts to your pension. Um, and that stuff amounts to these no longer being attractive jobs. Mayor Wheeler issued a state of emergency ahead of the strike, allowing the city to hire or reallocate staff to ensure services continue. Meantime, these workers hope the city recognizes their worth. They need to start addressing their employees' concerns because they're going to lose the best workforce in the whole city. Now tomorrow night, political leaders, community supporters and other groups plan to hold a rally in support of the striking city workers. It begins at 530 p.m. outside the wastewater treatment plant. Joe.